Heat Treatment of Ferrous Materials, brought to you by Oregon Tech. Before I talk about heat treatments, I should first define the terms. A ferrous material contains a large percentage of iron, and most, but not all, have magnetic properties, while a non-ferrous material contains little to no significant amount of iron. Heat treatments are a group of metalworking processes which involve heat to enhance or even optimize specific mechanical property characteristics. Depending on application of design specifications, annealing, normalizing, and tempering may be selected. Annealing refers to a heat treatment process in which a material is exposed to an elevated temperature. Then the material is held at this temperature for extended period amount of time. Then finally, slowly cooled in a furnace set at a significantly lower temperature. The annealing process, one, relieves internal stresses, two, increases softness, ductility, and toughness of a material, and three, produces a specific microstructure. Normalizing, or air quenching, is an annealing heat treatment. The difference is that the material slowly cools in ambient air versus in a furnace. This process, one, refines and decreases the average grain size, and two, produces more uniform and desirable size distribution. Tempering is a two-step process by which a material is held at an elevated temperature for a duration amount of time, water quenched, and then heated to a lower temperature for a specific time period, and then finally air quenched. This process, one, enhances the ductility and toughness, and two, relieves internal stresses. Now, please keep in mind the duration of time and the specific set temperature depends on the specific makeup of the material. Thank you for watching. This has been a video on heat treatments of ferrous materials.